I got these two pencil cases, which are really pretty. You see, this one says, today is a story worth telling, and this one is Be the Change. I got these at Walgreens for only eight bucks. <laughs> they look like they're like a million dollars. So then, I have, um, I have this um, English-Spanish dictionary. We don't even use these that much in school, but you have to buy one just so you can make the teachers happy. Then, I got this Marvel notebook. I don't even know where the other ones, oh yeah, here they are. Good. So, I got four of these, because that's how much it said. So I got a red one. Um, they said that this is supposed to be purple and pink, but I'm just going to color code them. And then this one I think is supposed to be yellow, but they never sell yellow notebooks. Then, I got this in car index card box. And uh, so this is my uh, pencil case. So basically what I'm going to do with this is um, I'm just going to take a couple of pens and pencils and only take this home for homework and stuff because you can't carry two big pencil cases home that adds weight to your backpack. So then I got these glue sticks and these are really useful. Elmer's is like the best brand in my opinion. Hopefully these should have lasted a whole year but we might have to replenish them. And then what I saw was the jackpot. These pizza erasers. I am so excited to try these because I am a big pizza fan. Like living in New York, I like the best pizza. Well, then I got these two red pens. This is for um, checking your work. I'm sure everyone across the country uses these. So then I got these um, colored pencils. They're not really colored because like they write in lead. They're lead pencils, but they just have a colored exterior which I kind of like. So then, we have these markers, and these actually have like five scented. The scented and the um, Crayola are like the best. So then, I got these. These are for the, um, the home pencil case. You know, like these are good enough for homework. Then, I got these crayons. These are actually the most durable. Because when you have regular crayons, they like easily break. Then I got these folders. So this is gonna be my take-home folder. And these three, they're like folders for like subjects they wanted them. You know, I think this one is uh, I don't know what this one's for, but I know this is like science and social studies. So then I got draft paper for math. And I got these. I mean, this is just extra. It's um, a J. And this is basically, I guess, for my locker and stuff. I don't know. I thought these were cute. Then, I got these highlighters. I like how they're the different colors. Then, I got this ruler. You know, this is a generic ruler. Pretty good. Anyways, my girl, like, she was just correcting me in the background. And then, this is the Sharpie that I'm going to mark everything with. And then I am going to put it in, your, in my pencil case, because to be honest, you never know when you need one. And then this is um, dry erase markers, and I am so excited for these, because last year, um, you know, like I didn't have them in colors, I just had red, um, black, blue, and green, that's it. And I so wanted pink and, pur um, and purple so bad, because I'm such a girly girl, so that's good. And then, so we have a whole another table of stuff that I need to bring over. Excuse me. Okay, anyways. So, these are the blue pens that I'm going to be using for school. You know, for like everything. And pens actually run out very quickly. So this is only going to last me till like, you know, October or November. Not even. Then, what happened with the scissors was, I saw one pair of scissors, I'm like, I'll get it, they don't have any pink ones. But then I found a pink one, and I thought, you're going to need two scissors anyways for the school year, one you might get lost. So I'm just going to bring them both. And then, I got whiteout, which is great, is that this year, they didn't say no whiteout on the supply list. Because I always make mistakes very easily with pen, and I always have to cross it out and it looks sloppy. 
So I definitely need this. Then I got a protractor. This is for mass. It's funny because we're only going to use this for one unit. But still, you need it for that one unit. Then I got post-its. They told us to get four of them. But it's like four packs together. So this should be enough. Then I got index cards. Like last year I got two of these in colored. But so many people kept asking me to borrow them because they, they wanted the color and I didn't have any left for myself. So this year it's going to be like, color for me, white for you. Also because the white extra for me at the same time, maybe I should get um, another color pack. But anyways, so this is construction paper and um, you know it's the same type of got that I got last year. And this is um, loose leaf, which you're actually going to need a lot, because in my school we write everything on loose leaf. Uh, okay. The blocks of you, I'm sorry. Okay. And then this, I also think is a pretty good jackpot, because it has um, a pen, um, this is an eraser that looks like french fries. And then this is a pencil sharpener, it's a hamburger, and I'm a huge um, hamburger and fries fan. And this is very important because what happened is I erase so much when I use pencil that I run out of my eraser quickly and these actually last pretty long too so that's good. And then this, these stuff were the hardest to find. They are five section um, binders, well, not binders but they have, like loose leaf paper in them. We had to like go to a couple of stores to find these. I got it in red. Black, black. One of these are supposed to be yellow, but I'm just going to color code it. And then this one is blue, which in my opinion is the prettiest. And then, ugh, they're heavy. Um, wait. Oh, yeah. I think I. Oh, my gosh. I don't even know if I presented. Oh, yeah. This is, um, this is, uh, band aids for the gut, um, for my locker. So then that way, if anything, like, what happens all the time, this happened to me a bunch last year, is I would store the books on like a shelf, like so many of them, and then all of a sudden they just fall on me, like they fall on my foot. Like one time it even fell on my head, and I would always have to go like... That's why that locker thing comes in here. That won't happen. Yeah. Wait, can you get the locker thing? So this is my sketchbook for art. I used it for um, a field trip. See, like I did sketches. And I got a four on it. Um, you know, my school system does fours, threes, twos, and ones. Four is the highest, and that's considered an A. So, this is my locker organizer. Aunt Judy got it for me. I would have picked different colors, but still, this is going to be really useful. Because if I put um, pink well, wallpaper in my locker, this is really going to complement, which is great. I can't have wallpaper in pink. It needs contrast. So, yeah, that's what it's going to look like. I just need to find the other puck. And my cousin Jack actually said that this was useful. And I also have some locker stuff. This was reused since the fifth grade. I'm going into seventh grade. So, this is my rock locker rug, which is in pretty good condition. Ooh. This is um, my mag. This is a magnet. It's a flower. And, um,. Julie actually looks nice with that. It really does. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Well, then this is um, a locker hanger. It just like looks really pretty. You open it. It's almost like curtains a little bit. And then a um, couple of uh, book stops. We have even more. We just have to find them. And then this is for the winter. It's like a little clip. It has a snowman on it. Um, so then I have a jewel magnet, another flower magnet, and these are from uh, Daisy's job, Castle Charities. So you know that um, we have plenty, oh yeah, and a New York magnet. So we have plenty of magnets, we just need to get wallpaper, and we'll probably post a vlog about us getting the wallpaper. And then back to school night, I'll even take a picture of uh, my locker. So, uh, yeah, that's all for today.
is going to be a really big vlog. Thanks for watching.